Hello friends, welcome back to All of the SAP. In this session, we are going to see how to create a simple query in SAP. A query is uh, a, something you fetch data from by selecting from the table by passing few data. So to fetch the data, then SAP has provided you a standard feature where you can combine multiple tables and then fetch data based on your input selection parameters to create a query transaction is sqvi i'm just creating the sales order i'm creating a one custom query buffer sales order so click on create sales order query here you can see whether it is a single table or table join you can you have to enter table join basic mode layout mode basic mode where you can see in a classic ALB format then layout will get data in ALB format and now I am inserting the table VP working then one more table VB AP Another table will be EP. So these three are sales order tables. So there are so this is three tables. Then I am going to select which are the tables, uh, which are the fields are required, and what will be the my input selection screen. Then go back. So now here you can see format then I am going to select here see this column will show which are which are the fields are selected for displaying this column you can see which are the fields you have selected for input selection so this is first table So first I am dragging this. So sales document will be my selection as well as input selection. Then date on which record was created. Entry time as required, name of the person required. Then Transaction group sales document is required. So sales are distribution channel division. I am going to add this setup document type in selection as well. So I want sales are this also in selection as well. So you can select based on your requirement. So I will take few from VPAP. So material number and then material group
quantity You can add whatever you require. Then I'm going to first schedule lines. You can take. So these are things I can add. There are multiple things you can set. And then what is the field? How column wise you can set some parameters here. I'm saving it. So let's see first execute this. You can see right whatever the selection parameters we have selected. Those you can see here. So I'm going to execute with standard else order document or and then execute. So you can see here or you can see click on L will list here. Okay. You can see here. Now you can create your own queries in SAP system. Thank you.